Hi guys, Claude Diamond here. A uh, question I always think about is, why do some salespeople make all the money they want with their good products and services and others struggle? Um, I had one salesman today who I have so much respect for. He uh, works for a satellite company. Um, he makes uh, three to six thousand dollars a week. Um, and he pays me so we practice and constantly work on his skills. And basically what he does is something that many of us dread in sales. He goes and knocks on doors all day long selling this cable satellite service. And he makes great money doing it. He has unbelievable it's been a mitigated goal. And, you know, for most of us, that would be a very scary thing to do. But that's the price he's willing to pay to make the money to have the success. Imagine going out in hot and cold weather and knocking on doors and people slamming the door and rejecting you and saying, go away. And, and just to get, and he does it constantly. He doesn't take it personally. He knows how to separate uh, who he is as a person as compared to other people who take it or the rejection very hard. And um, it's an amazing thing. And he really reminded me of when I first uh, I had a really good job a million years ago with a corporate America. I wasn't very happy there, and I wasn't making anywhere near the money I wanted in life. And I saw an ad in the paper. It kind of um, interested me. It was about a guy who uh, he sold tools off a truck, uh, industrial and automotive tools. And I spoke with the guy. He was real nice. And he said, why don't you just ride along with me? Take off your suit and tie, your three-piece suit, and I just want you to wear a work shirt and uh, some jeans and go out with me. Well, I went out with this guy and we drove to gas stations and industrial parks. And I don't know if it was luck or not, or he was trying to, <coughs> excuse me, trying to show off. He made a sale and he made more money in that one sale driving a pickup truck than I would make in probably two months in corporate America. And he did it in a lot less time. And I asked him, do you do this all the time? He says, yeah, you just got to knock on enough doors. I have great tools and stuff on the back of my truck. I buy them wholesale. And um, he says, just got to knock on enough doors. And sooner or later, someone says yes. And believe it or not, I, I quit that corporate job. I was there for years. I was on the upward um, uh, slide to go, going to management and everything. And I, but I wasn't happy. So I bought a pickup truck started selling tools off the back of a truck, uh, off the truck, and I started buying them wholesale. And I was making more money usually in a day than I was making in a month. And, and, and it was just pure, go out there, knock on enough doors, not, don't take it personally. This is tough selling. Uh, this is hard selling. But the question I want you to ask yourself is, would you be willing to do this? Could you knock on enough doors, talk to, a, speak with enough prospects, and if you have a good product or service and you have a gut sales system, sooner or later, someone will say yes. Or are you just sitting there listening to the crickets waiting for the phone to ring? And this is the difference between a proactive gut salesperson and everyone else. And so if you want to make the money you deserve, you're going to have to be creative. You're going to have to be different. You have to have a mitigated goal. And you have to put your emotions, your your humility, you have to put it on the shelf, okay, and not let anything else affect you and watch what happens to your income. This is Claude Diamond with another gut sales training moment. Go out there, sell something, have fun, and do what you love. The money will always follow. And you know what I'm going to say next. I answer my own phone. Just call me anytime, 970-726-7979, or go to my webpage and schedule a free training session. Take care.